Hollywood Lifers, it's Bonnie, and I'm here today with Diana Falzone, our relationship expert, and we've got a lot of relationships that we've got to talk about. First of all, let's discuss Justin and Selena. Are they going to be able to get it together? Is jealousy going to drive them apart? What do you think, Diana? I think Jelena is here to stay. We're going to see a little bit of a roller coaster romance because they're young and they're figuring it out, and they're both gigantic pop stars. And Justin Bieber, as we saw at the Victoria's Secret show, he's curious. He likes well, the attention. Of, well, of course. He's only 18 years <laughs> old, and he's been dating her for two years. Right. You think he'd want to you know, sow his wild oats a little bit, at a, least a play the bit. field a little bit. Yeah, I think it's going to get old fast for him. I believe that he's going to... The field. To, the field. Yes. There's, there's not always greener pastures, and you learn that as you get older to hold on what you know and what's mm -hmm. good. And there's a trust. They both relate to each other on a level that no one else can. He knows that Selena has his back and vice versa. And let's not forget, too, that Selena has her fair share of admirers. She's beautiful, she's young, and there's a ton of men that would be happy to take her out. Some A-listers, I'm sure. Oh. So Justin, watch out. Now, let's move on to Taylor Swift and Harry Styles. Now, Taylor isn't somebody to just kind of, you know, date anyone. No. It seems that every single guy that she dates is high profile. Is she just gonna, I mean, like stepping right into heartbreak with Harry Styles? Because who's a bigger ladies man than Harry? The only direction is down, Taylor. <laughs> Let's just go there. I'm sorry. I love Taylor Swift. She's such a sweetheart. And unlike many of us who made our mistakes when we were teenagers and young women, we don't have the world watching. She's got the entire world weighing in on her not so personal life. And and she is making mistakes. She just jumps in so fast and she falls in love and she lets them know it. I mean, she is literally probably sitting across the table going, we're going to get married and I'm going to write lyrics right now <laughs> about how much I love you. And then the next guy, but I love you even more than I love the guy last week. She's just a little boy crazy, so she needs to tone it down. But you know what? She's only 22. I think she's entitled to be a little boy crazy at 22. Yes, but There's not when wrong with that. But people are making a mockery of it and it's overshadowing her true talent for music. I just want her to go back to like the source of Taylor. What what does Taylor want? Here? At least she gets back at them right away <laughs> yes. with I will never ever ever date you again. I love that. And then just sweep all the award <laughs> shows and then every time be like ha ha. Revenge. <laughs> exactly revenge. That's the best revenge. Write a song about it, win an award exactly. or two or three. Yeah, 100. Now there is a couple though that you you think is fantastic mm -hmm. and that's Ice T and Coco. You, you've told me you admire them. Tell us why they work. I do admire Ice-T and Coco. They work because there is a true admiration for each other, a genuine respect, and I think that's the most important thing. And then, of course, they're madly, they're madly in love for one another. And they've been to, together, I think, 12 years now. That's married a long for 12 time. Years. Long time to stay madly in love. Yes, and the way they've made it work was at first they were long distance and they communicated a lot, and then they moved in together, and they just were able to navigate through this crazy world being in the limelight, having people always judge their relationship, but at the end of the day, they always came back to each other. Well, congrats, Ice T and Coco. <laughs> We're glad that your love is strong. And Justin and Selena, Harry and Taylor, take a look at Coco and Ice T, learn from them, and have long and happy love lives. Yes. Thanks to Diane Fel Diana Felzone. Now, she also stars on Ice Loves Coco on E! at at 10 p.m. Eastern on Sunday. So make sure to tune in if you want to learn the lessons of love from Ice and Coco. That's right. And now like this video and subscribe to Hollywood Life. Thanks. Bye.